Hey guys, this is Al here again with another tutorial for the Seconds Count app. Make sure you comment in the comment section and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Alright, so today I'm going to show you guys how to use the functions in the Save Videos section and the Save Data Sheets section. Um, click on the Save Videos tab. Uh, once you open up the Save Videos tab, you can see that uh, the app will let you know how many videos you have stored into the app. And it also lets you know how much memory it's using in your phone, which is very important. Another useful function is you sorting out your videos. If you click on the Order By uh, tab, you can see that you can sort your videos by your name, the date, or by your favorite video, and that's if you marked it as your favorite. Uh, and if you want to know how to do that, it's another cool way of finding out some more functions on the application. Just click on the three dots on one of your saved videos, and it'll be another menu that pops open. All right, once that menu pops open, it leaves another group of functions for you to do to the video. You can rename the video to whatever you like the video to be named to. Uh, you also can save it to your camera roll, which saves it to your actual phone. You can send the video also to all streaming sites that's connected with the application and with your phone, such as Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, and etc. Also, you can mark the video as one of your favorite videos, like I said before, and this is where you can group it by favorite if that's your choice. And also, you can delete the video if necessary if you're not liking the video. Also, if you notice, each video is very detailed. If you look at the bottom of every video in uh, the saved video section, you can see it has its name there, the date, and the time you recorded it. And also, if you mark the video as a favorite, it will be a star that show up in that section, a yellow star that will show up in that section, letting you know that this video is one of your favorites. All of the functions that I just spoke about in the saved video section applies to the saved data sheet section. All you would have to do is click on the saved data sheet section, and you can see the same three dots, which is a menu, a drop down menu for each uh, sheet and you will have the same functions as you would have in the saved video section and you also can sort your uh, data sheets just as well as you can sort your videos in the saved video section. Okay, dokie guys, that's about it. <laughs> Thanks for watching. This is another tutorial video of Seconds Count. Make sure you comment in the comment section and subscribe to the YouTube channel, please. I'm begging you. <laughs>